Thank you for joining me on my hike across Scotland. We are at the Firth of Forth. We are doing the John Muir Way, the West Highland Way, and the Great Glen Way. Hey, welcome back. We are at the Avon Aqueduct. This uh, was just being cleaned. They had a cool machine that kind of floats on the water and skims stuff underneath. I don't know. It was half tractor, half pontoon boat. <laughs> Um, the noise down here, this is the Avon River. You can see how high we are over the river. I, that's a long way down. I, you know, the path that we were just taking took a lot, a lot of uphill to get to this point before the stairs. And then on the other side of the aqueduct, you can see the house down here. So it's a steep drop off. This certainly is not a river. Uh, aqueduct to me indicates kind of moving water. And this is at the highest point. So this is a levee or something, I guess, that they've put this on. I don't know that if it's a working canal or just simply moving water. It's a little bit of an intrigue. Met some great people along the path here. Um, so I'm excited about that and I'm ready to move on. I'm still along the Avon Aqueduct, but I turned on because this is really an exciting little piece of share. Um, when I'm kayaking, and specifically in northern Germany and Sweden and places like that, I guess Scotland now uh, can be added to the list. Uh, I, I know you can kayak around this country, but this restaurant and the support for the kayakers are really important. Um, because this is, you know, warm meals and, and pullaways. And we get them come up here and there's a whole kayak and boat harbor. Obviously there's a boat here docked. But this uh, definitely goes back to when we were in Glasgow. We saw the river boats just like this. So there's a, an entire river experience that can be had here. This is, uh, well, there's just a lot going on get a chance to spin around uh, starting with the dramatic clouds but in front of me we have you know broken down barn train tracks of course I'm walking along the canal and uh, then we got sheep and then we got nuclear plants and I guess coal or steel or something over there and then you got the very tail of the Firth of Forth before getting into the highlands and you those just happen pretty quickly. Okay, we're gonna get close to some wildlife, huh? This is as close as we've gotten so far. I assume we will get a lot closer on some of the other trails. Hey guys. Oh, look at the baby sheep. Well, it is that time of year. Little baby lambs. <laughs> Big landscape here. Just a lot to see.